Okay, good morning, guys. Today we have packed up the car because we are traveling. Woo! Didn't so, know when we'd be traveling again, but here it is. And so we are actually going somewhere special. And tonight we are actually staying in a train that has been converted into a tiny home. Oh, this is everything with you right next to me. So alive and tonight I'm thinking that I don't wanna go. This is everything with you right next to me. So alive and tonight I'm thinking that I don't wanna go. Okay, so it is actually our anniversary coming up, June 1st, and we will have been married seven years, and so we thought we'd take a quick getaway to the mountains, uh, where we can practice social distancing so well, um, and... There's literally no one around where we're staying, so. Yeah, we're gonna be on this little farmland, so we're super excited. Uh, we're actually still both will be working, but with us being able uh, to be remote right now, we can just be remote in a pretty place, and so... Uh, we're super excited uh, for where we're going to stay, and we wanted you guys to, to come along with us. Is that Mr. Mason? Yes. Fantastic. We're getting ready for your food right now. If you wouldn't mind pulling up right behind the Nissan. Yep. Thanks, man. You said it was the last time, but you keep coming back to tell me. Sorry that you take back all the things you said just to hurt me. I love just went cold. All right, we are driving up a mountain right now and my ears are popping like crazy. <laughs> Every time we come up to the mountain though, my ears pop like nonstop. Oh, Scott did not want you to hear the radio commercials while I was talking. I don't want to get filtered for music. <laughs> Copyright infringement. <laughs> so we just want to thank Epidemic Sound for sponsoring this. <laughs> <laughs> together again. You are back once more like everything's the same. To build my walls up, but you're taking them down. Okay, we're almost there, but I can't pretend. Now I have to get over you again. We're going to 51. Oh my gosh, she's so cute! Oh, we're here. It's amazing. It's so cute. Oh my god, look at that. And these views are unreal. Okay, let's go check it out. Road track. Oh my god, I'm not gonna wanna leave. Look at that, you can see all the mountains. Oh my god, I can't believe we're staying here. This is amazing. I'm so excited, so, so, so excited. Look at this baby. <gasps> oh, stop it. This is incredible. Oh, it smells so good. Oh my gosh, I don't know where to start. This is the cutest place ever. <gasps> We're like Karen and Nate. I'm totally going to be like Karen. Oh, I feel like crying. This is one of the most beautiful places ever. You guys, I'm still freaking out. Scott's getting some drone shots right now. I just can't believe it. Like this place is genuinely like a true retreat. I feel like I want to stay here way longer than two nights because it just already, I feel so relaxed. I feel so like at peace and I would say I feel really calm, but I'm so excited that I just, I can't get over it. Okay, so we just stopped off at Dollar General. We got some marshmallows so we can cook them out over the fire Essential. tonight. Uh, but we're just saying we love mountain towns because we have Dollar General right here. Like, check this out. So, right here. And then, and then right next right. to Dollar, Dollar General is... A ton of cows! You just gotta love mountain towns. 
Okay, so we just stopped off at a little pizza place and got ourselves some pizza. We uh, we actually was trying to get to a different place, but it turned out that place was closed and Ashley was actually craving pizza. <laughs> and so... I was so excited. It was like fresh made, very Italian. And I said, hey, do you guys have any of the Parmesan packets? I don't know what you were saying to them, but I'm just jumping in. And he was like, no, we don't have Parmesan packets. We have the real deal. What? I'm so excited. Also, I don't know if you guys have seen yet, but our new masks that somebody made us with the bees on. They're hive drive masks. What? It's going to be new merch. <laughs> That's where the money's at. <laughs> okay, guys, we just got our pizzas and we got back to our home for the night. Woo! So we're going to sit out here with a beautiful waterfall going, our train in the back. And we're gonna watch some Parks and Rec oh. outside on a deck. You guys, this is a dream! Ah, oh, freaking out! I woke up in the middle of the night. Ooh, na, na, na. And I wondered how you're always right. It gets me. Couldn't see what you saw in me. Ooh, na, na, na. But you showed me how to believe. Still gets me. Okay, so we've had a super relaxing evening in. I mean, I'm just, we're in awe of this place. But we're gonna go start the fire and roast some marshmallows and just chill. need to know that you're staying. travel. I mean, we take every opportunity we can to explore places, go to new places, and travel. But this is honestly one of the very first times that we've gotten away just to get away and relax, like just to stay put. We're definitely people who, when we're in new places, we want to see and do everything that we can. Um, but coming here, this is one of the first times that we're just like, you know what, let's not even worry about going out and checking anything out. Granted, thanks to coronavirus, a lot of places are closed anyways, but we're just trying to be really intentional about this time and resting, and honestly, I can't think of a better place to get away and just be. Okay, so we thought this morning, since we're feeling like we're at a spa, we thought it just <laughs> made sense to try and do some yoga. Let's get our yoga on. So we actually don't normally do yoga, <laughs> but we're gonna give it a shot. It just feels right. I can't even touch my toes, you guys. <laughs> Okay, 
Okay, so we just finished our yoga for today, and uh, how was it, babe? It was good, honestly. So, as you guys know, I hurt my back recently, had an old back injury. I'm not very flexible or agile, but it was really relaxing, and we did a mobility one. So, yeah, it was fun. Okay, so we just uh, finished our morning yoga. You know, uh, our usual routine, <laughs> it's whatever. We started the day off with a cup of tea and coffee, as and you some guys saw. Coco Pablas. Some Coco Pablas. <laughs> And now we're gonna actually go for a walk. Uh, the guy, the owner yesterday was telling us that he actually just recently excavated a like, like a path, a like a road up yeah. to the top of this place. And so he said to check it out. He said there's some great views. And so that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna go and walk up here and check out the view. And hopefully we meet their goat marshal because I love me some goat. We're absolutely loving our uh, stay here. Um, I think Ash told you it's just kind of nice to get away and to actually just have a place of relaxing, uh, not kind of go, go, go. That being said, this hill isn't very relaxing right now. Uh, but we are absolutely loving it. And honestly, we don't just say this. I know, I think you know by now, we're very much people that make the most of every situation. And we just have fun and enjoy <laughs> yeah, wherever we are. But we really, like this place and we really think that this is like one of our favorite places that we've stayed in. For sure. Uh, I'm super out of breath. I'm gonna, we should wait till we're at the I'm gonna finish this at the top. <laughs> Which doesn't really convey how steep this is, but it's, it's pretty steep. Yeah, this is, this is actually quite the, quite the hike. It's so pretty though, <laughs> like in the middle. Of his, just the, the fact that in I have this on the all property. In the middle of all these trees. It's but yeah, he was just like, oh yeah, I created this pathway. You can just walk up to the top. Oh my gosh. I don't know how he did this, did but not, I'm really impressed. Did not expect this. You shall not pass. We made it to the top. Okay, now I'll tell you what I was trying to tell you. We were just saying that we think this is like one of our most favorite places in which we've stayed uh, for multiple reasons. One, just the fact that it's so private, so yeah. secluded. You just feel like so on your own. But then again, you can drive into the town, which is like probably like a 15, 10, minute? 15 minute drive. Yeah. Uh, it's like a little town, but I mean, it has like your grocery stores and stuff like that. So that's really cool. Uh, but then also just like the landscape, like everything oh around gosh, it is amazing. just incredible. And then uh, the other thing is just also like the uniqueness of this place. Like not only uh, is it a beautiful place, the fact that it's like a 1920, what, 1926? 1926 train car turned into a tiny home with this massive deck house, bathroom area. It's just, it's unreal. It's so unique, so original. Yeah, and so like it just feels like, like just it kind of like checks off everything like yeah. it's just got this place to come relax it's got the uniqueness but then also like the luxury to it um so yeah we're we're, we're loving we're it we're big fans obviously okay so we uh it's just started to rain so we're actually gonna head back down uh we especially don't want to be caught on these super <laughs> steep muddy trails especially if it starts with my... if it starts raining real bad <laughs> especially with my uh clumsiness record we don't need any of that nonsense <laughs> It's like, it was hard coming up and we're like, oh, it'd be great going back down, but it's like, it's so wet and slippy. It's like, oh my gosh, this is kind of, kind of crazy. Okay, so we're home and we're going to make a cheese board. Uh, Notice how quickly I call everywhere home. Home, yeah. You can have all the cupboard out if I get to have all the coffee out. Okay. The truth is, teleworking has never looked or sounded so good before. Oh, the man. Okay guys, so it's the evening time now and we're just getting ready to head to bed. Uh, but we had a great day. Uh, just this evening we actually got to meet the whole host family and they were just so sweet and it was just awesome to get to meet them. And they actually took us out on their side-by-side -side car and even gave us a chance to go and drive it, which was just so fun. Are you 
remember I told you how steep it was this morning? <laughs> it's a whole lot easier this way. <laughs> tiny house caboose and we just want to soak it all in and take it easy and chill so that's where we're gonna leave you guys and we'll see you tomorrow Okay guys, so we just had a great morning here. It's our last morning, so we've just been packing up and we're about to hit the road, but we've just had such a great time here and it was just a, such a special way just to celebrate our seven year anniversary. So we hope you guys enjoyed getting to see a glimpse of this super unique and special tiny home. We're actually releasing a bonus video with what? a full tour um, later this week, so be on the lookout for that. Make sure you're subscribed so you'll know straight away when that video goes live. And if you haven't already, go ahead and thumbs up this like video um, but yeah we love getting to share this special tiny home with you guys and we look forward to sharing more unique stays with you guys in the future and we will be back next week wow.